It's HCTV. Uh huh. Come on. HCTV. That's right. HCTV. Uh huh. In your house. HCTV. Uh-huh. HCTV, come on, it's HCTV. That's right. In your house, <laughs> what you watching? <clears throat> Yo, how do you feel about Colin Flaherty? Okay, to me personally, a person who's awake in this matrix, right? I feel like Colin Flaherty. It's kind of like an agent in plain sight. Because to me, when I go to his page, it's like, it's, it's so much racism. It's so much hatred. Whatever comes out of his mouth that I've heard come out of his mouth is so derogatory and disrespectful to black people. You know what I'm saying? Because see, how I look at it is, black people is not the only people that's causing violence or doing violence in this world. Black people seem to be the most targeted people that get exposed for it. You know what I'm saying? Which mm -hmm. we know we can we can take it and stop it from this point right here, from what's going on here in America right now, and go back to a slavery time. Who was the gang? Who who was the biggest gang of killers? Then, when our treaty or uh, deal was to, I will go with you to help you build up your country. And in turn, we want this, this, and this. If, if you can feel what I'm saying. Mm -hmm. That was the deal. But no. What happened? Halfway over here. Thrown in the water. People got chained up. A lot of the men got killed. A lot of the women got killed. But you kept majority of the women and children to kind of like brainwash them. To have it in their psyche when they have children. And things like that. Y'all did this. You know what I'm saying? Who was the biggest gang of killers? Y'all want to talk about violence? Right. Violence to me has been here since. I'm going to go here with it. I know it's a lot of non-believers and things like that. But even when it came to Yahshua. Right? When it came to Yahshua. Man, they murdered him. But they tortured him until he died. Getting back to Colin. I think he's an agent in plain sight because look at it as soon as you turn it on it's just what black people are doing and you're talking dirty and grimy about them like they're the only people that's doing this a lot of this stuff a lot of these things that black people do Mex Mexican, Spanish, white whatever, Chinese, whatever a lot of the violence comes from maybe Having a mental issue, being on alcohol, being on drugs, which we all know what can be the outcome if you do these things. Mm -hmm. So a lot of this stuff is coming from that right there, but a lot of it is probably like kind of like on some get back shit. Like y'all did all this to us, so nigga fuck you, punch you upside your head and shit, and do this to you and do that to you. You know what I'm saying? But you want to make it seem like the black people is just doing it for nothing, like they're just crazy people. We're not, the, we're not just a bunch of crazy people. We've been programmed over the years and years and years of the hatred that you cast upon us throughout the years. We've been programmed with that so much, we might retaliate and do something back to you. It sounds natural. <laughs> it sounds like a natural course, you know what I'm saying? So it's not like we... Just are born naturally um, devilish, should I say. I'm not going to sugarcoat it. Because all violence, to me, is like devilish with demonic behavior. You know what I'm saying? Then you do have some who be sitting back thinking like, Yeah, you did all this to my people. And now I can't take no more because you're still doing it. And now I'm going to go upside your motherfucking head. And now you want to put me on... Blast in front of millions of people on TV Like I'm the biggest crook and criminal In the motherfucking um, nation You know what I'm saying like, like my group of people is just the nastiest group of people And it's not like that This shit comes from somewhere It stems from a place Deep down in the hearts of people You know what I'm saying Him exposing black people violence 
and not exposing his own people's violence, it lets you see in plain sight that that's an agent trying to start a race war. He said he uh, doing it for the money. And if he's doing it for the money, he's straight doing it for the devil himself. So in reality, okay, we can see what you're doing. We, I mean, we can see exactly what you're doing and accept it now. Okay, you, you're doing it for money. Okay, so now it's two sides of this. Okay, they fighting for the demons, we fighting for the gods. So it's, it's, it's always been a war. But if you're doing it for money, it's definitely a demonic behavior. It's nothing godly like about it. Look at this motherfucking way that he talks to talks about us. And don't talk about his own as if it never goes like his people don't never do nothing.